The way that can be articulately described is not the unchanging way. The name that can be said out loud is not the unchanging name. With your mouth unopened and things left undefined, you stand at the beginning of the universe. Make definitions and you are the measure of all creation. Thus, being forever without desire, you look deeply into the transcendent. By constantly harboring desire, your vision is beset by all the things around you. These two enter the world alike, but their names are different. Alike, they are called profound and remote. Profound and remote, and again more so, this is the gate to all mysteries. Everybody understands the beautiful to be beautiful, but this only creates the concept of ugly. Everybody understands the good to be good, but this only creates the concept of bad. There can be no existence without non-existence, no difficult without easy, no long without short, no high without low. And without the sounds of musical instruments and human voices, where would their harmony and cacophony be? Before and after only depend on which one follows first. Therefore, the sage resides in non-fabrication and conducts himself according to wordless teachings. All objects in the world come into existence, but he does not judge them. They are born, but he does not possess them. The sage acts, but relies on nothing. He accomplishes and moves on. By moving on, he never has to leave. Do not respect the clever, and the people will not be induced to conflict. Do not be impressed by hard-to-get material things, and the people will not be induced to covet what they lack and grab what is not theirs. Do not stare at the desirable, and the people will not be induced to entangling thoughts. Therefore, the sage manages the flow of their activities like this. He empties their minds, but fills their stomachs. He weakens their willfulness, but strengthens their bones. He constantly leads the people towards less knowledge and less desire. Thus, masters and wise men will not dare to act. Act without fabrication, and there will be nothing you cannot manage. The way is as empty as an empty bowl, yet when used, it never fills. Deep and ill-defined, it resembles the distant ancestor of all things. It blunts sharp edges, unravels their tangles, softens their blazing light, and blends one with their dust. Gentle and overflowing, it always seems to be there. I don't know who gives it birth, it appears to precede the creator of us all. <laughs> 